There's so much more to streaming video than just binge watching shows on Netflix. Streaming expert Abby Reyes is here now with some ways to go beyond the basics and start streaming like a pro. Hi, Abby. I think this is something all of us want to do. Hi, I'm glad to hear that. It's always something that I do quite often, so very glad to hear. All right, so let's talk about some of your secrets to getting the most out of our streaming players. I think some of the secrets that I can offer is the first one is to really find the right player that's for you. Um, there is a wide range of players out there. I, for one, am always traveling, I'm always on the go, so I offer something like the Roku Streaming Stick Plus. It's about the size of a USB drive, and you can put it in your purse, plug it into a hotel room, and just pick up right where you left off. The second thing is to learn where to find free content. Um, streaming nowadays, there's so much content available. There are literally thousands of channels and even more movies and TV episodes. So sometimes it can be hard to navigate. Um, but luckily, there are things like the Roku channel, um, which gives you access to free entertainment at just the touch of a button, which is really, really great. I mean, and the last thing that I could probably say is to um, use a feature on the Roku device called private listening. Now, private listening lets you plug in headphones into your remote or your mobile app and it mutes the TV. So if you're like me, Meryl, and you like to binge late at night, it's a really great way to not disturb the person next to you. <laughs> that would be really helpful. All right, so for folks who may be expert <laughs> streamers already, what are some tips that they may not even know about their device? Yes, definitely. Expert streamers may not know that there is actually a feature called voice search. So voice search allows you to just, at the touch of a button, search for your favorite actor, movie, director, TV show, whatever. And the cool thing is, is that on Roku, we sort by price. So the lowest price always comes first. We always are trying to deliver value to our customers, which is great. Okay, so for folks who are still on cable and they're thinking about cutting the cord, what do we need to know to make sure we get the plan that's right for us? Well, cord cutting is a great way to save money. So again, the key thing is really just finding the right player that, that works for you. If you're someone who wants that full 4K experience, then you would maybe opt for something like the Roku Ultra. But if you're just wanting to dip your toe into streaming, something like the Roku Express, which is just $29.99, is a great entry-level device. And again, uh, I think a lot, folks, a lot of folks don't really understand that a lot of the content that's on cable is actually available for free on streaming services. So it's it's just a matter of identifying, identifying what the right service is for you. All right, Abby, thanks so much for being with us today. We appreciate it. Thanks so much. All right, you can get more information online at Roku.com. And be sure to add the News Channel 5 channel to your Roku menu for the latest news, weather, and talk of the town, streaming 24 hours a day.